In this example, we're going to examine dog and cat ownership. We'll be using Minitab Express. Here's our research question. Is there a relationship between dog and cat ownership in the population of all World Campus STAT 200 students? At the beginning of the fall 2016 semester, data were collected from a representative sample of World Campus STAT 200 students. Each individual was asked, do you own a dog? Yes or no? And do you own a cat? Yes or no? Because we're examining the relationship between two categorical variables, we're going to be conducting a chi-square test of independence. Let's go to Minitab Express. Here's our fall 2016 student data set. To conduct a chi-square test of independence, we'll go to Statistics, Tables, Cross-Tabulation, and Chi-square. The variables that we're interested in are dog ownership and cat ownership. Under Display, we're going to request the Chi-Square Test for Association. This will give us our Chi-Square Test Statistic and our p-value. We also want to ask for expected cell counts. An assumption of a Chi-Square Test of Independence is that all expected values are at least 5. When we click OK, we get our contingency table. For each cell, we have the observed count, so the actual number that occurred in our sample. Below that, we have the expected count or expected value. All of our expected values are at least five, so we can conduct a chi-square test of independence. Step one is to write our hypotheses. The null hypothesis is that there is not a relationship between the two variables in the population. The alternative hypothesis is that there is a relationship between the two variables in the population. Step two is to find our chi-square test statistic. In this course, we're always going to be using the Pearson chi-square test statistic, which here is 1.77. Step three is to determine the p-value, which we're given to be 0 0.1833. Step four is to make a decision. Our p-value is greater than the standard alpha level of 0.05, so we're going to fail to reject the null hypothesis. And finally, step five is to state our conclusion in terms of the original research question. There is not evidence of a relationship between dog ownership and cat ownership in the population of all World Campus STAT 200 students.